Anyway, welcome to LEGO News. This is something I decided to start after vlogs didn't do good. I will continue to do vlogs only on future special occasions. But let me tell you what LEGO News is about. So this will mainly only be about new customs, LEGO drama. But anyway, we have some spicy stuff for this week. Wait, before we start, I just want to say if you missed out on purchasing Brickmania's Captain Ramius, they should do a second batch because... Captain Ramius sold out in like six hours, but when it does come out, do not wait and purchase it later. They always sell out quick. Okay, the first thing I want to talk about is coming out Friday. This is Captain John Paul Jones. They are making this figure in the honor of the U.S. Navy's birthday on October 13th. This will come out 8 a.m. Central Time, so be ready to purchase it. I don't think they're going to be doing a second batch because the Navy only has a birthday once per year. Okay guys, the next thing that is coming out is the SS Dust version 2 Minifico figure. I don't have an exact date for this figure, but it will be coming soon. If you're not exactly sure what the Dutch Legion are, they were Dutch volunteer units for the SS during World War II. I don't have an exact price, but it's probably going to be about $15. I don't think it's going to come with the head, it's probably just going to be just the legs and the body. But, they probably will be coming out with a special... Special helmet for the figure. The next figure that is going to be coming out soon is a Soviet mid-war body. This particular figure will probably come in multiple variations, but the only particular variation that Minifigco is showing right now is the rifleman. He will have a leather belt, knee pads, and a dark gray uniform along with tan pants. Dan Siskin has been working on the World War I Royal Aircraft SE-5A. There's going to be a plain gray version and a tan version. The planes will have the markings with the Canadian ace Billy Bishop from the 85th Squadron. He hasn't announced the price, but don't get your hopes up because this won't come out in quite a while. He's still making the prototypes, and the printing of new pieces and boxes will take a long time. The biggest project Dan Siskin has been working on is the HMS Warspite main battery battleship. He's only he's finished the prototype but he hasn't announced the price and he did say for the first batch he's only going to make 50 of them. The photo I have up on screen is the prototype so don't get super excited because this probably isn't going to be the finished product. Okay so guys the last item is literally just a honorable mention. It's not a custom, it's just something I thought it would be cool to bring up. Anyway so Minifig Co made the Starship Troopers landing ship. So, they made these 50 metal intergalactic Starship Trooper coins for people who purchased it, and they only made 50 of them. So, I anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe if you're not already. If this video gets 10 likes, I will do a review on the Brick Mania figure, Captain Ramius, and I will also continue Brick News. Anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe, leave a like, and have a nice day. Bye, guys.